Hello everyone, this is Apartment on Wheels. I got a power inverter that I want us to check out today. It's called Duralast Inverter, 1000 watts. Uh, this thing now is saying LUP, which is like low power usage. Uh, I got it connected just to this little coffee machine. See, it shuts right off, and there you go with the LUP again. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shut this thing back off again. As you can see, it's off. And the coffee machine's off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this coffee machine back off. And I'm going to turn this back on. And voila, it says 11.8 volts. Just a little while ago it had 12 volts. So uh, there's something wrong with this inverter because it's not working at all. Because right here, I'll plug this in again. There goes the green. And it shuts it right off again. Trying to say some type of security or something like that, that it's not working too good. Uh, the LUP here means low vo voltage shutoff. The 12 volt DC power supply drops below 10.5 volts. Well, it didn't drop below 10.5 volts because, as you can see, it was right on there. So these inverters are actually junk. So if you get one of these inverters, stay away from them. It's not even working, as you can see. Look, the thing's just buzzing, going crazy. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick this back up again. I'm going to shut this off here. Okay. And I'm going to hit it again once more. Let's see what it comes up to. See, 11.9 volts. So it's obviously it's charging. It's not that bad. It's not even below the 10.5 volts as they, they said that it was going to start shutting this thing off. So we're going to hit this again so you guys can see. Watch, should start tripping it soon. There it goes. See, see how it says LUP again? I shut it right off. So, uh, the bottom line is, I'm going to shut this damn thing off, as you can see, just to quiet it down. I shut it down. This is this is all connected to a new battery right here, this power inverter, and it's just junk. So, if you guys turn around and get yourself a power inverter, make sure it's something that's good. I got a new uh, uh, marine battery back there from Advanced uh, Automobile. Uh, they said 12 volts is okay if it dropped down to 4 to be a concern. So even that thing said, you know, uh, 10.5. And the thing is, do you see it right here? I just want to make sure I had the right manual so you guys could see it. But uh, it's junk. A lot of these inverters will turn around. I'll tell you, they, they promise the world. Uh, this thing powered my TV, my DVR, uh, pretty good alone. But anything else, like you've seen as a coffee machine, this stuff does not work. Uh, there was a guy here on YouTube that was called the Inverter Man. He was funny. He had uh, the, the same uh, uh, inverter against another 1,200-watt inverter, and he's running vacuum cleaners. I like to know how he's running vacuum cleaners, why I can't even run a uh, coffee machine here. And this is like a 550-watt because that thing shows how much water this thing pulls. So uh, the word of caution is if you're going to be spending some time or you got yourself a van or even a vehicle, make sure you get the right power inverter because you're going to be in trouble. Because this thing was supposed to be running a thousand watts continuous. It's really a two thousand watt uh, uh, inverter, and the thing is supposed to be a thousand watts. And I'll tell you what, it's not even powering a coffee machine. So just use caution, because if not, you're gonna be you're gonna be in uh, trouble. Uh, if you have any questions, just uh, you know, just uh, call me back, and I'll get back to you. And that's about it. Make sure you have yourselves a great day. Thank you. Bye bye.